This is the most out of pocket podcast hosted by. Welcome back to the most out of pocket podcast. I'm Professor Joe, and I'll be your host today. Today we'll be talking about viral things and trends. Okay, so a really stupid trend back then was the cinnamon spoon trend, which PSA, this is not okay, don't do this, where they just grabbed a whole entire spoonful of cinnamon and they just popped it in their mouth and tried to swallow it. I'd do that. Yummy. I'd do that. No, it's not okay because you're just going to cup it out and it's just going all over the place. It always reminded me of like, that one scene in White Chicks, where he's like, well, your breath, well, your mom breastfeeds like this. And he, like, well, blows up. <laughs> 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 like, Is your mom so old when she breastfeeds it with powder? Yeah. Oh. That's, what, that's what, like, when they shove a spoonful of cinnamon in their mouth, and they're like, Ugh! and then they feel like, poo, it's everywhere. <laughs> All right, another thing you should definitely not eat that was a trend is um, Tide Pods. You see, I know they're very squishy and fun to hold. Don't take that out of context. Like and, you know, you can <laughs> just want to, like, bite into it. Just rah! But Tide Pods are not good to eat, to eat, even if they smell good, even if they look like they taste good. Don't eat Tide Pods. Did any of y'all ever do that? Yes. No. Try a Tide Pod? I no. Okay. I thought just about, thought about it. it. I thought about it. I, I, didn't, I didn't feel like getting all that money. Oxyclean. Even get the tough stains out. I don't like <laughs> filling the the uh, you know like either the dishwasher or the or the the washing machine. And you're like, man, that's <laughs> yours. <Yeah. laughs> that's really good. Maybe that's why like all like that generation just really 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 wanted to try it. Maybe it tastes like gushers. Well, but it didn't. Are. Okay, Miss Alvin. <laughs> I swear, none of us have ever PSA. eaten a Tide Pod. Yeah, PSA. Um, don't eat Tide Pods. Not okay. Hi, guys. I think we should bring back Devious Licks. Yeah. Dubious or Licks. Or as Miss Alvin, Alvin called it, Dubious Licks. <laughs> or a woman. Where we just steal things and lick them. Yes. yes. That's what she thought it was. Yeah, that's what she thought it was. <laughs> Everyone laugh uncomfortably. Uh, <laughs> 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 okay. Right, Miss Alvin? Uncomfortable so, like, laugh. She said yes. <laughs> trends and viral things, TikTok is full of that. I really like recently uh the chick-fil-a girl was oh like, my God. no chick-fil-a sauce she got fired for that what happened i don't know what you're talking she, about. all she did was like take this chick's order it was her sister they were doing like this bit it was to be funny she didn't like violate anything all she did was make funny faces and no chick-fil-a sauce you know that's all she did and then yeah. she got fired what i don't know why hashtag justice for chick-fil-a that's what i'm Chick-fil-A saying lady. chick-fil-a lady bring her Chick-fil-A. back she's fine and then <laughs> um they saw what it that name chick-fil-a lady she's giggling anyway um and then the uh what's his name is it maxington i think his name is i don't know oh, some guy on tiktok he started this thing because like People would use this video for when you're alone in an Uber and it's uncomfortable kind of thing. Oh, and his are darling. <laughs> Guess he's back from jail. And then he gives you like a prompt to follow, and it's always like, "Yes, my lord, he is free." That kind of thing. And it's so funny. Does anybody else remember um, Bingus the cat? Yes. <laughs> Bingus was oh, looks like Mew, but in real life. Miss <laughs> Alvin, look up look up a picture of Bingus the cat. <laughs> Absolutely adorable. Oh, and like, just somehow show it on the podcast. One episode. thing that <laughs> genuinely like changed in our era of people, Big Chungus. <gasps> Big Chungus. Big Chungus. Never again. What? That. That's Bingus. Everyone should have Bingus. Hi, Bingus. Hi, Bingus. Hi, Bingus. Hi, Bingus. Hi, Bingus. But that like guest speaker Bingus. formed our whole generation. Or and fidget spinners. That too. Just been Dab it. Like, <laughs> watching watching Subway Surfers with like a movie scene on top <laughs> is something that I love. I'm just like, oh my god, that's so good. Like, watch 32 parts to the singular movie on TikTok. I, I don't I, have to go anywhere. I remember more. I was used to watch those a lot, but mainly it was The Simpsons. Grey's Oops. Anatomy, I got it. 32 <laughs> parts or more on TikTok. Done. Easy. Wow. It's so, oh, I, I love it. Was, guys, I miss dabbing. Ew, Damn, why, would why would you ever want to do? Bring it back. I hate no, Oro. Oro, what are those? Like I still do that. Like, I still yeah. go, boy. I love what doing are those? that. I, I hate that y'all brought up dabbing and I'm wearing a dab shirt. Well, that's on uh, you. That's just on you. Just get better. Hey, my mom gave me this. <laughs> Not my problem. 
you decided to wear it. That's on you. You no, chose I, your fate. I grab random shirts every day. From where? <laughs> My own clothing. Okay. Okay. So, like, if you just find a random shirt on the side of the road, you just <laughs> put that back away on. I do no. that. Just, no, I, I have a washing watch. machine. Okay, I'm gonna do it. <laughs> if it's a cool shirt, yeah. Yes, it's mm. mine. I don't care if it's on the side. I'm gonna wash it like five times though. All right, what Corey, what, what were you talking about? Oh, all right. Um, when people used to go into stores and go into the ice cream aisle and lick the ice cream because a girl went viral on a video of doing it and then everybody thought hmm, this is a great idea to go into a local grocery store find the ice cream pull it back lick it and then put it back yeah. in yeah, there for somebody else to buy like people who eat grapes out of the bag at walmart without buying it yeah no but it was like it was like that something. but a lot worse that's that's just so disgusting like, if you're because they were at mine licking the ice cream and then they consumed. put it back what if they have like the sexual. flu yeah that's uh, how what, what if, if they have aids how, what if that's how COVID got started guys it wasn't a bat it was the ice cream <laughs> right <laughs> <laughs> loser licking chocolate chip mint ice cream yeah, someone bought it and spread it you saw caramel's good but it's not that good people kept getting caught doing it and I've never understood why would you do that? Why would you? I remember one time uh, we were at the store and um, there were like two Walmart dudes, big, buff, giant Walmart dudes sitting there, you know, mm-hmm. like in the ice cream aisle, making sure nobody did it because um, apparently someone had gotten away with doing it to like six. Oh my god. Uh-huh. Oh my god. Like, can you imagine back to back to back with like ice cream? <laughs> You okay? And, yeah, uh, okay. They would have to like you know watch you like just okay, pick out your ice cream. Is. And let me just say, as a seven year old trying to pick out some Chucky e. Chip ice cream and not being able to without you know Mr. Big uh, Walmart guy be like, <sighs> don't let, don't get that ice cream, boy. Don't do it. You let your mama pick that out. Yeah. <laughs> it was my mama who did it last time. <laughs> All right, um, you two goofballs. What are, what are y'all doing? I another deadly. Uh. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Another deadly food trick is the pink sauce. And basically, there's this lady who made a small business of a sauce that you eat with like chicken or anything. And basically, it was ranch chicken. with like dragon fruit <laughs> blended in. And that what that's what makes the pink sauce. And basically she was shipping it out to people and when it arrived to their house, it was all melted and disgust disgusting and like rotted. Yeah, and there's milk in it. Oh and, like, yeah, and no why are you shipping that to people? Yeah. That's why would people buy it? Was it a white woman? It was a white it was a white woman that explains everything. <laughs> yeah. Well, I mean if you really just wanted like some all right, hear me out here. If you get like upset stomachs from eating like chicken and stuff, and you want some pink sauce, just like get some chicken, dip in some Pepto Bismol, and you eat two birds with one stone. Simple. Cane sauce. I'm is an pink. I, I'm an I idea love man. Miss Alvin, what do you think about um, chicken and Pepto Bismol? New trend idea? What? Tell us, audience of like 32 people, should we try that chicken and Pepto Bismol? All right, guys. If I bring the Pepto Bismol, who's bringing the chicken Monday? <laughs> I'll, I'll try it. I'm down to try that. I'll, I'll, br- I'll buy I'll a like, oh, I don't want to try that. Imagine dino nuggies <laughs> and like cherry <laughs> Pepto Bismol. <laughs> and then chugging that bad boy down with some Dr. Pepper. <laughs> I love Dr. Pepper! New topic, Miss Alvin? PSA. This is not okay. Um, <laughs> oh, yeah. I, well, we don't know. We haven't tried it. No, we PSA, don't, we don't take this is for not fun. okay. Let the scientists <laughs> like me that. try it out, and <laughs> next time I'll let you know how it went. PSA. I could be dead. I don't know. We'll figure it out. If you though, don't hear the voice in the next one, something happens. <laughs> okay, so a trend that is not a trend, though, like a wild thing that's, that's like, um, has been viral like a few months ago it's like the sephora kid <laughs> and um so it's basically just a bunch of kids who would go to sephora and just cause trouble and just like cause a mess there and i have one friend she's in texas and oh, she boy. she goes to sephora a, a lot like a lot and she told me that she's now scared of kids who's there she don't want to like even interact with them anymore it's valid yeah they definitely bite they do? Yeah, I bite yeah, back, I but harder. So. Ah. You're like, give me a pony. Or it's with your ankles, sir. Gone. Oh, that's cute. What if I just throw you? Just, rah, really, just throw you out of storage. <laughs> what about you, Belle? Oh, that's right. You didn't pick anything, did you? 
Never mind, Belle. Hey, Sean, tell us how's it going. Hey, Belle. <laughs> I'm thinking of Sephora. What are our thoughts on black things? Not good. Terrible. They shouldn't be good. <laughs> <laughs> There's only one thought. <laughs> Why would you put a... When I hear that song, Black Feet. Terrible. Uh, Horrible. Oh. Have y'all seen that video? Yeah, that one. I have not. I don't know. It's just this kid going around Sephora, all black face stuff. You. Oh my God. Mother not holding her children accountable. Um, yeah. Yeah, if it was up to me, um, that child would be out of my home. That child was well, no well old enough to know that no, that was wrong. Like Kid's going to start children. living on a cardboard box. <laughs> Can we normalize beating children? <laughs> PSA, this is not okay. PSA, that is not okay. Don't do that. Um, timeout is acceptable or um, a slap on the wrist. I don't know. You, you do you, man. Just don't beat your kids. That's not good. Anyway, what about you, Mariposa? How, how's it going over there? Did you what? Anyway. Uh, <laughs> uh, yeah, I was going to be talking about the, well, used to be famous. Makeup artist James Charles. <gasps> Five minutes. Who was, uh, I guess, caught apparently like grooming underage oh, boys. Yeah. Did oh. he like admit to that though? Yeah, and then he was like, Wasn't oh, there, no, like text I guess messages I guess of evidence of him being like hitting yeah. on like he went somewhere. They were like 16. Something. I know that and one of them was straight. One of them was like 17, and oh, apparently smart. James was like first. Oh, uh, first before that, before the allegations come out, he got like in trouble for hitting on straight people mm. and like trying to force them into like oh yeah did you see the thing being queer it became a trend mm. of james charles hitting up people and like their dms and sending them his requirements and stuff oh trying to God, basically ask so them out and be like you need to follow this that's so <laughs> gross that's weird that's not like gross. he automatically and didn't he also have that weirdest such weird, the weirdest obsession with that one dude for like the longest time mm -hmm. Like, one thing that I just This is why America love. won. Yeah. <laughs> Whatever. Yeah. I don't know what you said. <laughs> but uh, one thing that I just absolutely love is when people who go viral on the internet end up being bad people, and then they disappear for a few months and try to ease themselves back onto the internet. And, and then we're like, like we what are you do. still <laughs> doing here? <laughs> isn't that what everybody... Is not is that why people keep blowing JoJo Seawood? Yes. Uh, what happened to Jojo Siwa? I don't even know what she did. They just bully her, and I think it's funny. No, I hate Jojo Siwa. One time she tried to come out with gay numbers, like, you're know, all gay, you're staying up for attention. Yeah, I think so. Isn't she, like, having kids now? No. Yeah, she got three oh, their no. names tattooed. Do you know who is apparently pregnant with the kid, though? What? Apparently. Gypsy. Yeah, Gypsy apparently being she's pregnant. she's pregnant. I heard like, there's something about a divorce scandal. and that she's pregnant, but I don't think she's divorced. Because I don't she think still so. Because she still pictures apparently of her. And she's blonde, though. Yeah. Her What's wrong with blonde? blonde Nothing. <laughs> <laughs> but like, I followed this one girl called MySpace Mama on TikTok, and she was basically like really into the early two thousand stuff. Two minutes. Two minutes. Okay. What are you talking about? Was that already? But um, she was really into like early two thousands, like MySpace, like the style Y two K stuff, and then it turns out that she was severely racist. Uh -huh. Okay, and then she was like, "This is my apology video. This is when it happened." This is coming out. I'm sorry, that kind of thing. And then people obviously like shamed her off of the internet. And then not even two weeks, not even two weeks, she comes back and like acts like nothing happened. And then people are like, well, "What are you still doing here? Why are you here?" Ooh. One person I can't stand on the internet: that vegan teacher. <laughs> oh my oh, god, yeah. she's hilarious. <laughs> like, oh. I remember uh, when she was a huge trend on TikTok, and I think she got bullied so bad she left and went on like. YouTube there were so many rumors going around about that lady that she was pregnant. I've heard so many weird things about I her. I feel bad for the baby. That's I mean, not. I feel food bad every day. For That's rough. I, know. I feel bad. Do you think she would be against God. like no. breastfeeding? Probably. Yeah, I'm a self, but that's that crazy. vegan teacher. Yeah. Or Nikocabo Avocado. Ah! <laughs> I like that so much! He's right. so funny! All right, so, you know, here's a backstory that most people don't know about Nikocabo Avocado. One minute, all right, just one more minute, Miss Alvin, please. All right, so, um, <laughs> Nikocabo Avocado was actually very skinny, very healthy. Yeah, yeah he, he, was, was, he, was, he was a bodybuilder. Yeah, and then, like, one day, he just, like, I'm done. And he like starts his first of many Gorging videos. Gorging yeah, himself. On like fast food and everything unhealthy. 
and then became kind of a meme icon. This he was hilarious. He's hilarious. Oh, he's got I funny. I love that guy. So funny. I feel, yeah, but I wondered, like, what pushed him to the edge of, like, just quit? I was like, carrots aren't that bad, guys. So let's be real here. They aren't that <laughs> I bad. I love lettuce. <laughs> the ramen, the chicken, that's what gets you. Oh, the, we're going to uh, wrap it up. Intense amount that wasn't one minute, Miss Albin. That was about 20 seconds. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, fine. Since Miss Alvin uh, doesn't want us to talk anymore, um, this is all for this week. Bye now. <laughs> <laughs>